I'm gonna tell you two things that I love about the new Panasonic G92 and one thing that I'm not a huge fan of. So to start out, the image stabilization in this camera is incredible. In the camera body alone, it contains eight stops of image stabilization. And even when zoomed in at a full 800 millimeter full frame equivalent, this footage looks fantastic. Now, another thing that I really like about the Panasonic G92 as a wildlife photographer is its new pre-burst function. It can capture up to 60 frames per second, a second and a half before you actually click the shutter, meaning that you can prep images ahead of time, and then when the bird takes off or lands on a perch, you can click the shutter and it'll backlog a whole second and a half's worth of bursted photos. Now, the one thing that I'm not a huge fan of about this camera is that it doesn't hold up that great in low light. In low light scenarios, it winds up being a little noisy and a little grainy, just like other Micro Four Thirds sensors, and this camera is no exception to that. 